Hi guys, in this lesson we will talk about the Spring request body. Spring provides a request body annotation for REST API. The request body annotation maps the HTTP request body to a transfer or domain object, enabling automatic deserialization of the inbound HTTP request body onto a Java object. If a method parameter is annotated with request body, Spring will bind the incoming HTTP request body to that parameter. While doing that, Spring will use HTTP message converters to convert the HTTP request body into domain object. Spring provides many default HTTP message converters which will be used for conversion depending on the presence of a certain library in project classpad. Of course, we can use different content types in Spring like JSON, XML, etc. For example, if the content type in request header is application JSON, that means the post body contains JSON. And if JSON library is found in your classpad, Spring will delegate the conversion to JSON HTTP message converter for JSON. We will see the details of it on our project. That's all for the beginning. Thank you.